take a hit Some, some, we got some content. Now let me give y'all some series. Give me a shot of whiskey. Give me a shot of Give me a cup. Get the mouth out the ground. Is the camera rolling? Huh? The camera rolling? Yeah, the camera rolling. All right. So, yeah, bro, I see you. Um, give me a shot of that whiskey, bro. Hold on, fool. Let me ask him real quick. Cup. Wait, let I mean, well, this ain't wait, whiskey. Wait a but minute. It, you know. <laughs> I'm hey, shit. <laughs> hey, listen. Sorry, let me ask him. Boy. Let me ask him a question, bro. Ask him. You keep cutting me out. Listen. So you you was at no, Drewski no. house, right? What, oh what? shit! I poured too much. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. So so. What what you say, cousin? You, was, you, you know, I'm, I'm Charleston White grandson too. So my bad. Nah, you, yeah. No, nah, you're not related. Yeah. But uh. You uh you was with Drewski and shit, right? You was at his crib. Yeah, I what was at his crib. You know he live in LA. Yeah. You know he flew me out. You know he he I got flewed out. You know by a nigga with money. You know he a millionaire and shit. You know so I got flewed out. Um, I'm not gonna tell you how much money he gave me. He gave me a, a, a he gave me them bangings, the money on. Um, I got there to his big ass mansion. I walked in. But I ain't gonna lie, his fat ass really was just treating me as if I was, you know what I'm saying, just a regular person. You know, like, he, he was treating all the other people that was in the house, you know, like, shit. You know, he was cussing everybody out, but he wasn't doing me like that because he just knew, like, I'm a real crip nigga. So he was like, nah, I can't do him like that. I'm not trying to get fucked up. He was like, I'm not trying to get fucked up. So he didn't do me like that. You know, and I noticed that. I was looking at everybody else get treated real bad and shit. He was cussing everybody else out and stuff like that. But he wasn't doing me like that. You know, and I, I really had fun in the house. And one thing about these reality shows is they take your telephone away. And you can't have your phone. So I'm up in there with all these other retarded ass motherfuckers. And I can't even have my phone to vent to my mama or nobody and shit like that. So I was, re you know, you just got to understand what type of position I was in. I was in a fucked up position. I ain't had my telephone. I ain't have my Apple Watch. You see, I got my Apple Watch on right now. I got my Apple Watch on. I, I can't have none of this shit. But, you know, I had to really just put my big boy pants on. My big boy. Notice I said boy. I had to put my big man pants on and really be a man and stand there and deal with that shit. You know what I'm saying? So, like, being in the house, it was a different experience, but I was able to get through it. And I ain't win the show, but I made it all that's, the way to the end. That's your man's? Man, cozy in the mouth with me. You feel okay. me? Yeah. I, I, I can feel all that my problem and situation. Yeah. So I done been through some dangerous shit. I done lost. <laughs> man, I done lost. My kid, one of my babies, mm -hmm. grandma, baby mama, granddaddy, mama. I had to bury my mama two, about two months ago. I mean, you look like my baby, dog. Rest I in peace, her soul. I can relate to anything you're talking about. Yeah. It go. Yeah. See, he can relate to everything I'm talking about. <laughs> he he know. So, like, you know what I'm saying? So like you, you around Chris Brown and shit, too, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, and I ain't gonna lie. Fuck with him, bro. <laughs> Damn. What'd he do to you, bro? Breezy, cool. Right. You know what I'm saying? Now you just right now. I ain't gonna lie. Let me tell you about Chris Brown. Yeah. Now, excuse me, y'all. I'm finna say some gay. Hey, take your time and speak your okay. mind, bro. I'm finna speak. Oh, I'm finna speak my mind. Yeah. Oh, I'm finna go off. Now, I ain't gonna lie, when Chris Brown when Chris Brown walked in, I ain't gonna lie, I wanted to suck them balls through them drawers. Hey, bro. You told me to speak my mind. Um, but <laughs> when Chris Brown when, where you going? He told right, me to I'm speak. A, I'm gonna go check on him. He, I want to suck them balls through them drawers. But I'm not going to lie, like, Chris Brown, he kind of, like, looked a little different than how he did on that music video, you know, where he was, the grass is greener on the other side. The grass is greener on the other side. And 
the way he looked at on the music video then how he looked at at the could have been house it just looked at like you know, he lost a little weight. You know, he wasn't as masculine, muscular as he was on the music video. Like, he just looked at a little different. Like, he had been using. So, you're some, saying you wanted him? That I wanted him? Yeah. But when I saw him in person, he looked a little different than he do on television. I'm not going to lie. He looked like he'd been doing a little bit of that. You know, you know what I'm saying? Doing a little bit of that stuff they say that people be doing. So he just looked at a little different and I just was not fucking with it. So I don't know. I just don't think that Chris Brown is the same Chris Brown as we we see on TV. You know how they be saying they be cloning people. You know how they be saying they be cloning people and shit like that. Like I think some shit like that had happened because like he just did not look the same. So yeah. Where they going? Okay. Wiki, where they going? They gone. They leaving? Yeah, they left. What did I do? Did I do something wrong? They, they, ain't, they ain't with the, the, you know, the sucking balls. Oh. Um, I stay here because I'm in my show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because this, this is your place. This is your house. This is my shit. This is your place. You can't leave. I can't go no more. You got to stay here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>